Hello there, mi amigos. It's your boy, here to talk to you about the four components of fitness. So, without further ado, let's get right into it. The four components of fitness are cardiorespiratory fitness, muscular strength, muscular endurance, and flexibility. Throughout this video, I will tell you about the four components. I will also have pictures for each component as examples. First, I'm going to tell you about cardiorespiratory fitness. Cardiorespiratory fitness, also known as cardio, is the efficiency of the heart, blood vessels, and lungs during sustained vigorous activity. Here we have a picture of a young lad doing some cardio. How can you tell this is cardio, I hear you ask? Well, you see, this boy is running. RUN, BOY, RUN! And running is a perfect example of cardio, because when you run, more blood pumps into your muscles, so you have your heart working hard and efficiently to pump more blood. And you have your blood vessels working hard and efficiently to transport the blood to your muscles. But you also need more oxygen to pump more blood. So you also have your lungs working hard and efficiently to get more oxygen into your heart. Cardio branches off into two categories. Aerobic fitness and anaerobic fitness. Aerobic fitness is when the body supplies energy with oxygen for exercise of longer duration. Here we have a picture of a young child taking a lovely morning stroll without parental supervision. This is an example of aerobic fitness. The reason this is an example of aerobic fitness is because walking does not take much effort, so there is not a lot of blood pumping into the muscles, so the body can easily and steadily supply energy with oxygen, but still at an efficient rate. Some examples of aerobic fitness include climbing upstairs, Jogging, walking, biking, and swimming. Anaerobic fitness is when the body supplies energy without oxygen for a short term, high energy demand exercise. Here's a picture of a young boy sprinting. This here is an example of anaerobic fitness. The reason this is an example of anaerobic fitness is because he is sprinting, and sprinting requires a lot of energy. So much, even, that just oxygen isn't enough. The body uses your stored energy to fuel you while doing anaerobic fitness, but using up so much energy, you use up the stored energy quickly. That's why it's difficult to do it even for a short time. That's also why you breathe so heavily afterwards. Your body is so desperate for energy, it needs more oxygen. More. Some examples of aerobic fitness are hockey, uphill skiing, sprinting, doing the worm, and breakdancing in general. <laughs> We now have the next component, muscular strength. Muscular strength is the maximal force that a muscle can exert when making a single contraction. Here we have a picture of a strong man lifting weights. Although it doesn't seem like he's doing it properly, at least to me, this is an example of muscular strength. This is an example of muscular strength because when lifting weights, especially one that heavy, you tend to only make one single contraction of the muscles. Some examples of muscular strength include bench press, deadlift, wrestling, and football. The next component we have is muscular endurance. Muscular endurance is the ability of muscles to sustain or repeat muscle contractions. Here we have a boy trying his best to do push-ups. Even if he can only do like five, it is still an example of muscular endurance. This is an example of muscular endurance because when doing push-ups, you are constantly repeating muscle contractions when pushing yourself up and down. Some examples of muscular endurance include do push-ups, sit-ups, wrestling, and air squats. The final component we have is flexibility. Flexibility is the range of motion or movement possible at a particular joint or series of joints. 
Here we have a, holy crap, that boy is flexible. As I was saying, here we have a picture of an amazing boy showing off his extreme flexibility. This is a good example of flexibility. This is an example of flexibility because he is most likely using the maximum movement of multiple joints to create such an impressive and, dare I say it, attractive stance. Example time. Some examples of flexibility include UFC, the Stand and Reach Fitness Test, and a hockey goalie. You know, making this video, I have learned a lot. I learned about things like how there are actually two types of cardio. I learned what types of things were examples of each component. I also learned the limits and how far people can go in each component. This whole thing has been a fantastic and fun educational ride for me, and I hope that you could say the same. Thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed it, and this is your boy, signing out. See ya!